So what's the point of this video? I think it's important for us as the developer community to be practicing these things because a lot of the future is moving toward this conversational way of talking with our devices. Uh, not just devices, but our code. And learning all of these techniques is important so that we can be ready for what's to come. Um, notice that I haven't even talked about ServiceNow products, now assist, um, all of that kind of stuff. Yeah, because I want to be transparent. Um, a lot of the work that we do is utilizing what tools that we have, not necessarily just ServiceNow AI tools, but things like Claude or ChatGPT or Cursor.ai. Um, it's part of our tool set and I use them and I want to make sure that we're all talking about it as a community. And if you happen to catch the ServiceNow CreatorCon keynote from Knowledge 2025, we actually demoed that we are bringing conversational coding into the ServiceNow interface, both within the ServiceNow ID and within just ServiceNow Studio. So we are going to be conversationally coding, vibe coding, to create entire apps, to edit code, etc. cetera. Um, and so it is also moving toward that way. And like how it's been, it's optional to you, but there's so much power in a well knowledgeable service now developer being equipped with tools that will only make us go faster. I want people to be using these tools responsibly. So review the code. Don't push things to production unless you know exactly what it's doing. All that stuff is still applicable here, but I can code these widgets from scratch. I can write ServiceNow scripts from scratch. I know a lot of ServiceNow methods from memory and I can type out a lot of this stuff myself. But if something can do it for me so quickly and accurately, then why would I waste my time doing it by hand? I still have reservations from people that don't know ServiceNow coding to be using these tools um, without like review and stuff like that because they can't review it. They don't know how it works. Uh, but for a lot of you that knows ServiceNow very well, I encourage you to get into these tools and let them do a lot of the work for you because other people aren't yet and your job is going to be so much easier now and you're going to look so far ahead of other people that are not using these tools. Uh, I said that about ChatGPT two years ago and I'm saying that about vibe coding now. It's the future of things and if you haven't tried it yet, just try it. A lot of things will go so much faster. Okay, bye.